We are back, back in WA. We flew in last night from the Gold Coast. Uh, arrived home at 2.30 this morning, in bed by three. Woke up at 8 a.m., that's five hours. Um, so basically today we're gonna show you guys uh, my new meal plan and how to get back on track um, after a holiday. So we've had a pretty cool um, increase in calories. We're now up to 3,800, so basically it's grow time. So we've lost the body fat, we got down to the weight that we wanted to be at. Now we're gonna just start putting on a bit of size. So today's first meal, what we're gonna be doing is we've still got the 150 grams of steak. We've got two rashes of bacon. Um, two eggs and now we've also got two slices of bread pudding so that's meal number one on the cooker um, and also a coffee don't forget the coffee and yeah we'll get to it So the flight last night was very long and very, very small, but it was good we are here. We're gonna do a bit of shopping today. Um, luckily we've got this one meal here, so we'll eat this meal and my next meal, then we'll go out and do some shopping and uh, show you guys what we get for um, this, yeah, this new meal plan. So like I said, we're sitting on three eight now, which is a pretty good increase, but mainly increase in carbs, which I'm quite happy with because I was feeling a little bit you know, low, um, wasn't getting the pumps and everything like that. But keen as a being for it. All right. All right, we've got the meal cooked. Um, so like I said, 150 grams of steak, two rashes of bacon, two eggs, and two slices of wholemeal uh, bread. So we're just gonna get this one down and then uh, move on to the next meal. going down we've had an increase we've gone from 70 grams to 100 grams of the oats so we get this thing on the cooker beautiful 100 grams on the dot find just covering them up a little bit um, seems to be the best way of doing it and always go in for about a minute 30 and then see how we're looking all right so we've just done it um, like I said I put a little bit of extra water in there I kind of like mine to be a bit gluggy a lot of people seem to like theirs to be um, runny I'm not a fan of it best thing about my new meal plan is I do get Nutella right before my workout which is actually insane it's gonna be killer we're gonna have a little bit of a sugar pump which would be cool Five grams, so I actually don't know how much five grams is going to work out to be. Hopefully that much. A little bit over five grams, but you know what? That's fine. <laughs> Let's chuck that on there. Oh, wasteful Nutella. All right, let's mix this around, see what it's like. I've never actually done this before, guys, so... This is an uh, experiment for myself, so I, I pray to God I have not just stuffed my Nutella roll. 100 grams of oats, 8 grams of Nutella instead of 5, don't tell anyone. Oh damn, that is good. That is bloody good. Well, this is my uh, pre-workout. I'm going to smash this down, half an hour time, hit the gym, and then we'll go to the shops. Let's do it. Most important thing is getting the food done. So we've got our um, all the meats that we kind of need today. Have to come back each day, kind of get our dinners and whatnot. But uh, we walked through the lolly aisle, 
that is uh, pretty exciting because uh, well, I don't get any of that this week. But all in well, I've just had about a week's worth of donuts, so <laughs> let's get on it. Just got back from the shopping, put all the shopping away and everything like that. Uh, we've done a quick little leg workout. I'll be honest, it was not that good. Uh, four hours sleep um, takes it out on you. What we're doing now is we're just gonna make my quick protein shake and chucking on the rice. So basically how I do my rice is I cook up one cup, I uh, split that into two days, so it works at 250 grams today, 250 grams tomorrow. Put this in there, and then I put about two and a little bit cups more water on. Main focus is the meal which I'm doing now, so meal number three is my protein shake. All it is is a scoop of WPI. We use a DNT Nutrition brand. One banana. One juicy banana. and 15 grams of the light peanut butter. Now I did have eight grams of Nutella this morning, so they're recalculated and I'm allowed to have, I think it was seven grams of this. So, let's be honest, everyone wants more Nutella than peanut butter. Ten grams. Boom, we'll just let that cook. Best part about the 500 grams of beef mince is quite literally split that in half to two meals. Works out cooked about 220 grams. Uh, same as the cup of rice which I cooked on before. That's almost ready. Same thing, gonna put 250 grams of rice in um, and half this beef mince. Beef mince. And then uh, we'll be eating it. Beef mince, rice, 250 grams. And it was just 210 grams of beef mince it turned out to be cooked like. Obviously if you cook it a little bit more, it does cook, you know, it goes a bit lighter. But one thing I love doing is putting quite a lot of salt on there. I've only got um, table salt at the moment. I do prefer, prefer the um, Himalayan salt, but it is what it is. Nice amount of salt. So we're going to smash this meal down um, and then we're going to go for a quick ride on the Harley and then we'll be coming straight back here and basically prepping for the next meal. So let's get to it. Alright, so we're just going back for a ride on the Harley. Um, obviously been away for a week so thought I'd better take it for a little burn. We're just gonna prep the next meal up. So basically what it is, it's three full eggs. I kind of hard boil, soft boil them, so the yolk's still a little bit running. So it's about six minutes and 26 seconds. So don't ask what's specific on the number there. Uh, bagel, and then we'll be chucking some cream cheese on there in a second. But um, yeah, we'll let these guys cook, we'll get to it. All right, so freshly cooked, we've done the eggs, we've got 10 grams of cream cheese on our bagels. Again, like I said, I love my salt, so fucking bang. Six minutes and 26 seconds is the lucky number, check this out. Oh, perfection. Kid these guys not. Go six minutes 30, overcooks it. Six minutes 26, perfect. All right, I'm gonna enjoy this now.
feel about it. What you Alrighty guys, we've got the next meal going on here. Basically what we've got is the same thing as what we are having before, but a massive increase. We've gone from, I think it was 250 grams of potato, we've gone up to 380 grams. I've just cooked it up in the air fryer, absolutely love the air fryer. And we've still got the 150 grams of the chicken. Again, just cook the chicken on the fry pan, nice and easy. Uh, best part about it is we're using my secret herbs and spices. Absolutely love this stuff. Bit of salt, always love the salt. And one other thing I have with this one is a um, nice crunchy red apple. I've already eaten the apple, so now I'm just gonna enjoy this meal. major meal for the night. So we've got the 250 grams of salmon, 450 grams of sweet potato, air fry the sweet potato, comes out nice and soft. Uh, best thing to do is chuck it in the microwave first for about six minutes uh, with a bit of water in a bowl. Just softens them right up. One thing I always do is add a bit of like the no sugar, um, reduced, reduced sugar, sorry, tomato sauce. Just make it taste like a bit nicer. And the old salt. You're probably thinking, is he in his pyjamas? Yes, I am in my pyjamas, Peter Alexander. I'm a man which can happily say I wear pyjamas. So, that's just who I am. All right, I'm gonna get into this one now. Alrighty, so final wrap up for the day. We're gonna have our mixed berries and blueberries. So I buy the mixed berries and I also buy the blueberries because I kind of like to go about 80 grams of the mixed berries. So I always find they add a lot of blackberries in there. And then do the other 70 grams of the blueberries. Perfect. So the total should be 150 grams of berries. And I'll just grab the almonds out. And 30 grams of almonds. Absolutely perfect. So that's a wrap up of today, guys. Um, I hope you guys liked what we've seen. As I said, today is an increase in calories. So we've gone from 3.5 to 3.8. So we're basically now in the grow phase. Um, I'll add a few more videos on as the diet changes progressively and also we're going to obviously do a lot more training exercises So if you'd like to like and subscribe and then also leave a comment on what you prefer to see whether it's more training more holidays more nutrition Please be more holidays so I can get on more holidays um, or if it's just me in pajamas Honestly up to you guys. Alright, cheers